you guys and welcome back to another video. I'm gonna turn the air down so you guys can hear me a little better. It's too hot. So today I'm going to finally go to two garage sales. I don't want to say the second one is really a garage sale, but technically it is. I don't know. We'll see. The first one is definitely a garage sale and I have the map pulled up. It is 20 minutes away. If you guys are interested in going to garage sales, make sure you check out Facebook Marketplace. They have a lot of garage sales there. And yeah, that's what we're about to do today. The second garage sale I'm kind of skeptical about because it's called a Y2K garage sale. And I believe, I don't know, it looks like it's in a backyard or something. But I don't know, I'm really skeptical. You guys know Houston is one of the biggest cities for sex trafficking and all that. So I... I don't know, I'm 50-50 about it. So I'm gonna pull up there as well, but I'm gonna peep the scene before I decide to go inside. To me, that's weird that I have to go inside. Or I think it's in the backyard. If I can go to just the backyard, maybe, but I don't know. Like I said, I'm gonna have to see. All right, you guys, I made it to the first garage sale. There's a lot of people here. It looks like a lot of stuff. We'll see. And I don't know how garage sales work. I guess it depends by who's doing the garage sale. If I can just like, Apple Pay them or Zelle or Cash App because I don't I don't carry cash. You guys are gonna watch me park. Whew. I get nervous parking when there's a lot of people just backed up next to each other. Okay. All right, yeah. So let's look at the details of this place before it just says everything must go. I, I thought they. All right, it just says everything must go. It's a lot of stuff they have. Maybe they're leaving or whatever the case is. But let's. Let's go before they take all the goodies. They got lots of goodies. Oh, Smallville. I used to love this show. Oh, this is a good movie. I've never seen that. I'm still on the hunt for Hachi. I can easily buy it, but. Oh, this is cute. Cute. They got more DVDs. Oh, yeah. I just, I this is cute. Y'all yeah, know all that puzzles. Little cage. Oh, they got chairs. Y'all trying to cover something for the wall, like the holes I did? Get this. They got more. Ooh. Y'all need to watch this for Housewives. It's such a good show. Chucky. Katie William. Part of the Caveman's house. I don't know that one. <gasps> Ooh, they got Star Wars. What is this? The Complete Season 1. Clone Wars. This one. Oh, that's so cool. Very cool. Barber shop. Punked. Family guy. What is this? This is Smallville. They love Smallville. <laughs> More Desperate Housewives. Clone Wars. All right, I'm leaving because it's way too hot, but um, I met the owners, really, really nice people. It was just a nice encounter, very nice family. Unfortunately, I didn't get anything, but they said that they might have more stuff tomorrow, so we shall see if I come back tomorrow. Probably won't, but it was nice of them. Let's go to the next one. Um, let me see what time they close. Okay, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. All right, quick detour to home goods. <laughs> y'all know me, y'all know, y'all know how I am. So as soon as I walked in the store to my right, I saw all these beautiful florals, okay? They're putting the Halloween slash fall things out, okay? While I like to look at other things, I always like to stop at the garden section. So usually what I like to do is whenever I'm really trying to find something, I like to go to Home Goods or any store that's far away from where I live because like I keep telling y'all where I live, guys, it's, the stores, it's just very overcrowded, very popular. But if you kind of go like out the way, then trust me, you'll find what you're looking for. I know we passed the Scrabble board, but I wanted it because I like the glass. But honestly, for $39, like what? What kind of sale is that? The sales have not been sailing, you guys. The sales have been so bad. But anyways, y'all see this big pumpkin? $80 for this big, big, it was big and heavy. I saw so many Disney finds today at this store, guys. Stitch, Mickey, Jack, you name it. I saw many Mickey, as you guys can see. And you guys should be proud of me because I left with nothing. No mugs, nothing. I've been trying to do a lot better and slow down on my mug collection because if you guys know, if you guys have seen my mug collection, it is getting a little bit out of hand. So I'm trying to 
minimize my excessive shopping. I do have a thing for mugs. So I am trying to slow it down. But those Mickey ones, ooh, they were very, very tempting. Let's talk about the fall decor. Are we ready for fall slash October? I'm kind of ready, but I feel like this month flew so fast. Is that just me? I feel like August was just the blink of an eye, and now we're we're done. Like, we're done with this month. It's crazy. But that's how life starts to feel after you turn 18. It just flies by. And the next thing you know, we're 50, which is crazy. Because I'm, I'm going to turn... How old am I going to turn in December? I think I'm turning 24, which, like seriously 24 that's insane i was literally just 18 like i said yesterday it's crazy and that's another thing about me i'm already forget forgetful so i'm already like mm, how old am i turning 23 24 25 which one is it okay <laughs> like i'm already forgetting what like how old am i <laughs> embarrassing huh you think but i don't know i guess i'm just getting old this hello kitty mug guys i've been seeing a lot of hello kitty mugs and honestly uh eh, I'm a fan of Hello Kitty, but I'm not just, like, gonna grab anything Hello Kitty because I know what's nice and what isn't, and I'm sorry, but that mug just wasn't it for me. But back to my questions. Are you guys ready for October? Are we ready for fall? Are we ready for the spooky season? One thing that I love about the spooky season is what's surrounded by it, I guess, like ghosts, scare just being haunted houses i know i'm rambling but it's just all the things when i think of october that i like carving pumpkins that could be a date even the haunted house could be a date like it's just so many fun things and then you can talk about ghost stories like it, i don't know i i like stuff i like scary movies to me they're not really scary so this time of year i love it Guys, I am one of those people that's on the hunt for the Hello Kitty blanket and some spooky Hello Kitty decor. And let me tell you guys, if you don't know, there is a lot of people that are going in stores and buying Hello Kitty things and reselling it for double the price, which is so sad. It ruins it for the rest of us trying to find stuff. But honestly, that's... That's how it is with anything that's popular or viral. So, I was just obsessed and stuck on trying to find that hello kitty blanket for the longest but honestly i give up because it looks like all the resellers are finding it first and i'm not about to waste my gas going to 30 plus stores trying to find one blanket so it is what it is if i see it i see it if i don't then i guess it's just not meant to be but let's talk about this blanket guys i saw this blanket several times still tempted still tempted it's so cute and i love the colors this one, this one was cute as well. I don't know what's going on with me and flowers, but I'm digging it. Another thing that I love about fall is it's, at the, it's the beginning of kind of the cool weather. Guys, I'm over the heat, okay? I live in Houston. I'm so over the heat. It is too hot, so I'm definitely ready for a change. And for a change of scenery in my home too. Fall is the beginning of when I start decorating for different things. And then after fall, I get to decorate for Christmas. So I definitely love this time of year. All of these bath towels were so cute. They had so many options. Snoopy, Mickey, Jack-Jack. Oh my god, all the spooky finds. They were so cute. Alright, you guys. We finally made it to the Y2K garage sale. Yes, it was in their backyard. But let me tell you, I felt like I was at a party at a kickback or something very very nice house i wish that was my backyard guys oh my god i will show you guys a clip of it a little bit later after this it was beautiful breathtaking and they had their own cashier like what how rich are you guys <laughs> i appreciated that in this sale they put things by sizes small medium large so you didn't just have to be looking for things just assorted like smalls with mediums and all that no so everything was sorted which i really appreciated the only thing that i didn't love is that i could tell that people were watching me so i don't know that makes me a little bit uncomfortable when i shop all right you guys i just left the last yard sale which was the second and let me tell you guys i don't know if i got the best recording of the house because i didn't want to just be out showing my camera but y'all it was nice guys it was so nice. i felt like i was at a party they even had like a checkout cashier area and i'm like how much money do you guys have in my head like what the f what 
I felt like I was at a party. It was so beautiful. That Their backyard is goals. It's literally goals. It's such a nice backyard. It's beautiful. I felt like I was like a, at a kickback. It was very nice. So this is where they had that Y2K yard sale. And I'm sorry, but those prices were steep. Very, very steep prices. So I didn't get anything, but very nice, cute stuff. I think now I'm just gonna... I don't know. We'll see. I'm trying to see if I can hang out with one of my friends later on today, but... I'm waiting for her to call me back, so we shall see what the plan is for today. We've made it to Target. It's a little hectic. I love Target, but during the weekend, it's a different vibe. All right, we're at the bullseye area. Let's see what they got. Ooh, they got this. Starting to do the fall stuff. Really cute. What is this? This is kind of cute. If you ever need to remove some corn, <laughs> Not corn you eat, but this corn removers from this brand so so good now it is seven dollars But trust me this works. I know love me the good smell area. So let's see I always forget the ones I have I have Febreze and Glade, but I don't have I don't remember which one I have more of Clean mine and smells good. I try to be cuter and corn myself looking at the smells, but too many people in there so I'm on the next aisle looking at other stuff because you guys know I love looking at clean supplies. You guys know when you have the munchies but you don't know what you want? It's really stressful, okay? It's very, very stressful. It's like everything looks good but at the same time nothing looks good. I don't know. $34, that's text. We have a lot going on today, guys. I'm trying to record but it's a lot going on. Walt Disney, oh, that's cool. Got Daisy Duck, Ariel. Captain Hook, Wendy. Oh, Wendy looks so cute. Mermaid. What? What mermaid is that? Oh, from Peter Pan. What? I don't remember there being a mermaid on Peter Pan, but <laughs> Snoop Dogg. Ariel again. Got a lot of Ariels, guys. If you guys are interested, come to Target for some Ariels. Okay, does anybody remember these books when you were younger? Did you ever get these books and do the stuff like the worksheets and stuff to learn? This actually used to be fun. You guys know I love Stars Above. Love them. And they just came out with a new print. Oh, I gotta get it. But they have smalls and I like to do extra small. There's this one as well. I don't love the print. It's okay. It's very Hawaiian. And I'm not going for that vibe. But this, this I can do. I also need to get the gray set. The gray set is kind of hard to find. Uh, they have a small, but again, I want the extra small. I have this one. The, mm, I don't think they have the black one, but I'd rather do the blue than the black. Luckily, they don't have my size, cause <laughs> it's best that way. Okay, the shoe section is already, okay. Interesting, very nice. These are on sale. Six and a half. They look okay though. That's probably why they're on sale. But this is what they look like outside the box. They're not horrible. Okay, but how cute are these? Oh my god. Let me try these on. These are cute. Look, they got smiley faces. I love the color. More smiley just in pink. And these shoes. These shoes are very popular. People like these shoes. Look at this corset top. Oh my goodness. How much is this? Watch it be 20. Oh my god, it's about to be 20, y'all. $15. Better than expected. They have blue and gray. Here's what they look like on. What do y'all think? Hold on. I don't know, y'all. Mommy, I can do this in the car. Does this look weird on me? <laughs> I think it's because I'm wearing these. They're very cute, but I don't know if they're for me. And then this is what they look like from the front. Y'all let me know. Guys, I'm at the sales section and look what I found. Oh my god. Add to cart right now. Ooh, this green one. How much is this green one? The sale's not even that big, y'all. Like the sale is like, mm, this one, if I can find the other set. Okay, so I couldn't find any matching sets for any of these. But... I'll put this one back because this one's basic. This one's cute, but again, it doesn't have the bottom. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. Make sure you guys check out my shorts here on YouTube to see what I got from Target. I will see you guys next time. Bye.